Hey everybody, this is Brian. I've got a bit of a problem. I'm hoping somebody out there has a solution to. I'm running Ubuntu 16.04 long-term support, and I have got the newest version of Qt Creator 4.0. Well, newest as the time of this recording, which is based on Qt 5.60. Uh, and there's the build and everything. Um, what's going on is everything seems to work unless I do a QML project. And this is just you know a very basic project. There's nothing special to it, and uh, it seems to hang right here on engine load. So it'll make this QML application engine. And I'm not sure if it's engine load or if it's actually the constructor of this. I haven't really had a chance to deep dive into this thing. But what happens is when you run this, the application actually runs. And you see the application window blink down here. Now I can go in here, and I can access all of Qt Creator and everything seems to work while it's running but when I close this bad boy it's almost like you know everything freezes I don't know if you can hear me clicking but I'm trying to open that main CPP I could right click but nothing happens and it's just it's like it just freezes up so and you know even these side buttons here some work some don't it's like nothing really works here so um, I did actually kind of go out and Google this, but um, nobody else seems to have the answer either. Um, one person said go out and disable QML debugging, and I know I'm going to get a lot of those responses. And just for the record here, let me crack this project back open. Uh, QML debugging and profiling is disabled. Um, but same thing, when I go to run this, while it's running, I can do pretty much whatever I want to do. The minute I quit the application, it freezes up and just bam, doesn't work. Everything locks. The only way I found to fix it is to actually close out Qt Creator, which is a royal pain if you're trying to do any sort of development. So that's it. I'm hoping somebody has an answer to this. Otherwise, I'm going to have to move my QML tutorials to either my, my uh, Mac Airbook or my uh, Windows 10 installation. And I'd much prefer to stay in Ubuntu if possible. Thanks.